can't even begin to imagine working with my spouse, especially in a home office. So tell me, what's your secret? You know, I mean, I think that, you know, we originally started working together in college. Right. So we've been doing this longer than the 21 years we say. We've actually been doing it longer than that. But I think that our personalities are uh, are almost counter to working well together because we're both such strong personalities. Mm. Um, but it works for us it, because of our advocate, you know, for your position relationship that we, you know, the way that we work. Um, but also because I think our skill set is is not overlapping completely. So that's a big thing. Yeah, Although if our skill both, if we were tripping on each other, it would be problematic. Right. Well, while most people who had very strong personalities might clash and not work well together, I think that's exactly it. Because I have maybe um, a little more technical and execution expertise. You have a little more of marketing. the marketing and research and you know. You're more sensitive to color than I am, but I think we cross over in terms of those all those design issues of form and you know development of the right user process functions, whatever. Um, there's complementary and enough overlap. Yeah, we respect each other, and so there isn't um, sort of this train wreck coming down the track just because we're <laughs> married and working together. It 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 actually I think is a, a huge advantage. I think it is a huge advantage. I think that, you know, a lot of, it, it's, people think it's odd that we're a husband and wife design team. It, mm-hmm. Like, how can you possibly work together 24-7? And it's because we work together 24-7 that we're really good at what we do. Um, it's what makes us, us great because we never stop designing and we're okay with that. Right. You know, if you are one half of, uh, you know, husband and wife, in a husband and wife relationship and only one of you is a designer and one of you is working, then the other one has to put up with you never stopping to work, never stopping to sketch, never stopping thinking about the design as you're shopping. It could be frustrating, but for us, it's energizing. So it kind of, it works. Right. We and don't we, have to shut it off. I think we each feed on it. Yeah. And, um, Our kids might not like it so much, but uh, <laughs> they have to deal. So anyway, so that, I think that works for us. But I think it's also the hard part because, you know, if our business isn't successful or if our uh, royalties are low because sales aren't happening or it's Chinese New Year and not enough is shipping, <laughs> it's stressful because you don't have the other one to pick that up. But it's no different than if we were running a restaurant um, at, together. So there are lots of husband and wife teams out there running businesses we just happen to be designers doing it, um, and that's not as, as usual. So. I, I think the challenges we face are really no different yeah. than any other mom-and-pop type business. of business. Yeah. Um, but fortunately, I, I think it makes for much better design, uh, much better results. Right, and I, from a female perspective, from a businesswoman's perspective, it's you know a whole lot easier for me to be away on a business trip, going to China and doing these things, knowing that he's there, you're you're there, mm-hmm. to pick up and pick up the girls from school and keep my business running. Like I have a, such a high level of trust with that that I'm not worried about you know someone you know losing my job, someone taking over mm-hmm. or missing my kids, and someone not handling it so well. We have that complete trust level, and it just really works. And the reality is, is that you get married to your partner anyway. I mean, you had a different partner before me. That's so. right. Yeah. At one point, I was working with uh, uh, another college mate, um, good friend, and worked together. And and that actually was a whole lot more difficult. Uh, well, it's it kind of like the three of us were married, whether or not we really wanted it to That's be true. that way. Because he, you know, he was always there, and not that I don't love him, but he was always there. And it's just, you know, it's one of those things. So you do end up married to your partner, whether or not it's in physical vows or not. So right. So for it's us, it just makes more sense. It works better for us to actually be married in life and in business. And it's been our competitive advantage. So why That's not? <laughs> why not use it? No question. <laughs>